Okay, so this is horse-drawn carriage, just the first part, hands apart, one, one hand at a time. So it starts out right hand, starts out on B, goes up a third to D, down a second to C, down a second to B, down a second to A, down a second to G, up a second to A, up a second to B. Now here you cross your thumb under to C, then up a second, two finger on D, up a second to E, now four finger on F, F sharp here, and up a second to G, now we're coming down. F sharp, three on E, two on D, thumb on C, then your three crosses over to B, down a second to A, and up a second to B. Then the last two notes in that line are thumb on G, up a second to A, and then we're on this next page, B, up a third to your five on D, four on C, three on B, two on A, thumb on G, two on A, three on B, thumb crosses under to C, up to D, three on E, four on F sharp, five on G, four on F sharp, three on E, two on D, thumb on C, cross your three over and play B, and then four on C, two on A, thumb on G. That's the right hand. So now the left hand from the beginning on that first part, it's G chord, G, B, D, one, three, five, and then the D7, which is your pinky on F sharp, two on C, thumb on D, all together. That's D7. And then back to G chord. Then the next line, the left hand is alone on, not alone, but the left hand plays D just by itself. And then there's a rest, and then it's C with your two and thumb on D. Then the whole chord, G chord, G, B, D. D7. G, rest, 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 and then thumb on D, and then a rest, and then D7 to G. And that's the left hand. That's all we're doing this week is just the hands apart, one at a time, just like we just did. Okay.